today's spooktacular spot. Spot time, we're gonna look at the laser, Halloween laser pops. Candies, but they also have a little laser on the top that shows you a spooky sign. Imagine if the spooky sign, you turned it on and said this candy may contain poison. We shouldn't even joke about that. It is fruit flavored candy. Spot got himself a black one. I also got myself an orange one, which are the colors of Halloween. In some ridiculous schools, that would also be what they call Halloween. Oh no, we can't call it Halloween. What are we telling our children? No, we have to call it Orange and Black Day. Don't kid about that. That actually is true, at least here in Canada. It says, not a real laser. Don't expect to be slicing through ice, slicing up deli meat ham. It's not gonna happen, my friends, not even close. It says, safe LED light source. However, avoid pointing at eyes or you will get a fright you weren't expecting blind you will be blind it says battery powered do not disassemble batteries may cause serious injury if swallowed so many safe tidbits here on this candy the black candy or the black flashlight candy is strawberry however if you look at the orange one, which other than the canister being a different color, the labels are the exact same. They are also both strawberry. So realistically, Spot does not need to try both of them. Spot, try both of them! No, I actually don't have to try both of them because they're both strawberry. No, Spot, try both of them! No, I can't. I could, there's no point. They're both strawberry. No, Spot! I'm sorry. Anyways, to get the candy, we have to twist the bottom. And there's the candy right there. It kind of looks like a ring pop. Do they even make such a thing anymore? Ring pops? No? There's a little bit of wrapper on it. That's good. That means there's no hair, debris, fly carcasses, ew, ew, or anything else on this candy. Although the hardest aspect of it will be probably to open this. I, will I be able to... Hera, give me strength. Will I be able to actually open this? We'll cut it. We'll start it along its journey. We'll just cut it up with our knife. Kniffy. Which also you have to be very careful with. And there's one of the candies right there. Oh, it's Spot! No, it is actually the same candy that's in that one. We won't need to try both of them. Oh, Spot! So, let's give it a try. The strawberry candy. We'll give the candy first a try. Then we'll check out the laser laser here we go let's give it a try the strawberry halloween laser pops let's give it a try well hold on it tastes like strawberry candy but i gotta tell you it tastes like really 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 cheap strawberry dollar store candy like we're talking the cheapest of the cheapest it's okay at least it's strawberry and not some not like lemon or pineapple oh don't even get me started on those two but at least it's decent enough candy i would give this to the neighbor's kids that i don't like very much here you go that's for you hey laser pops and then they try the candy later and they flail their hands their little stumpy childlike hands okay so when you're finished you can put it back into the canister that keeps it protected that means the dog's not going to get to it don't let the dog get to the candy like this it's not going to be good for him so there's a little button on the top here equally so there's a little top button on the top of the orange one that when you press them they will project an image you may or may not be able to see what that image is the black one is a bat the orange one, however, is a ghost. You could have them fighting one another, although there would be no way to score points or to determine one over the other. But you can kind of just have fun like the ghost is ah, chasing the bat, and then the bat is ah, chasing the ghost. I think what we will do to get the full effect of these, we're going to dim the lights, we're going to check out the lasers. Sounds like fun. Oh, they're not real lasers. Don't want to squash your imagination there. But we'll... We'll check out the lasers in the dark. Okay, guys, I'm still here. I haven't gone anywhere. I'm still here. We're gonna try the lasers. 
the lasers in the dark and we're gonna see how well they project. Let's first try the black flashlight, which if you remember, was the bat. And let's zoom, 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 zoom. There's the bat right there, it's a bat. I think the further back, oh, there we go. Isn't that funny, eh? I thought it was a bat, it looks like an owl. What kind of funky wings does that owl have? But I didn't realize it until I pulled the laser further back. Pushing it further in, right there, that looks like a bat. Pulling it back though, no, 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 no way my friends, that's an owl. Whoo, says the owl. There's the owl. Okay, so let's try the orange one. We kind of already know it's a ghost. There's the ghost right there. It looks like a very happy ghost. We can pull it back ever so slightly. Hey, wait a minute. That's a donkey. No, it's not. No, Scott Spot's just pulling a trick on you. It's still a ghost. It's still a ghost, guys. But isn't that funny, though, eh? Turning off the lights and adjusting the lasers ever so much, quote unquote lasers, you can see that one is not a bat. It is, in fact, an owl. But they could still play one another. All right, guys, let's hit the lights. So the Halloween laser pops, quote unquote lasers, aren't really so much lasers as they are projection images. Funny enough, though, I thought it was a bat. Turns out, though, it's right even there. It's right up at the top there. It's an owl. It's an owl. There were other two as well. I see a witch and I see a jack-o'-lantern. I don't know if they were actually released. Maybe the... Maybe the different black ones had two different, maybe one was a owl, one was a witch, and the orange ones, one was a jack-o'-lantern, one was an ghost. I don't know why I had to put A-N. It was a ghost. Uh, candies were okay, but I guess the cooler aspects of it was at least the projected images, and we had a little fun along the way. Today's spooktacular spot, we were having a look, and by the way, this came to us from Exclusive Candy. You can't get this everywhere, you can, have, you can only get it at exclusive places. Exclusive places being the dollar store. Today, though, we're having a look at the Halloween laser pops. Certainly stay tuned, guys. Spot's going to have more spookerific reviews heading to you this month of Spotober. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Woo! It was actually now.